Hey guys, Mason here and welcome back to another video. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you the easiest way to complete the secret obby. Let's get right into this. So actually a gem just spawned, so I just want to collect this and toss it in if I can. Uh, grab this. Boom, boom, boom. Alright. And there we go. All I wanted was the gems. Okay, so for the secret obby, there are multiple ways you can complete this like pretty fastly. So you can get people to help you, and here, let's go over here. So one of the first ways, you can get people to help you, and you can have each person stand on one jump, but don't have anyone stand on the first jump, because the first jump is easy. Like, uh, I touched it there for a second. But you can have people stand on all the other jumps just to mark where it is, but you don't want to have people on every single jump, like maybe every other jump. Because the max people you can have in the server are like 8. So that means you're only going to be able to have 7 people on the tiles. Because one person has to go forward to try to get to the end. So you could do that if you have enough people to help you. But another way you can do it, a per one person showed me this. You can go to your settings. Th this way mostly only works on PC, because if you're mobile, it doesn't really work. But if you go over here and turn on click to move, but yeah, if you turn on click to move, you can still move around like normally, like every other way you normally. So you have to like, like right click for it to actually do it. So... Yeah, you have to right click for it to do it. If you just click your normal mouse and move around, nothing happens. So, if you click on it, you might realize that it doesn't actually bring you down there. So, you can just click on it and it will like show you where it is. So, let's click on it. I'm going to jump on that dot. So, yeah. And let's see if we can get this other one. It is pretty hard sometimes, right there. And sometimes it can glitch and like make you walk off. And that is super annoying whenever it does that. But you can use this to kind of help you. It's pretty useful, kind of. But yeah, <laughs> it is pretty hard though. Like, I've been clicking right now. I'm trying to do this. Am I lined up? Uh, So this way. So it should be like right here somewhere. But yeah. It is pretty hard to use, but it can help you on some jumps like this one. So yeah. I think it mostly works better whenever, like, it can, ah, when you can see the block. If it's invisible, I think it only works, like, sometimes. See, right there. Okay, that, that was risky, because, it, see, like that. It can make you walk off the edge, and it is very annoying whenever it does that. But it can be pretty helpful sometimes, so yeah. Let's go ahead and go out here. It would be nice if it, like, made you jump with it. If it made you, made you jump and like do everything, that would be super easy. Because then you could just click on the door. It can get you like past everything and stuff. So yeah. So yeah, that is one, another way you can do it. it. As I said, it's not the most useful, but it does help on some jumps. See, you shouldn't use it on like the super close jumps. So yeah. Don't use it on the super close jumps because pretty sure on the super close jumps it like just makes you walk forward because it's so close so it makes you walk off the edge. So go watch my other video on the secret obby because I showed a picture on there of like all of these things untransparent. So it will show you the path and stuff. So yeah, I can't really find the screenshot of, of that besides in that video so just go watch that video. Yeah. So, also, I'm going to be trying to complete this. Right once I complete it, I will instantly make a video of it. Because if y'all don't know, they added a door to the end of it. You can't really see it right now because it's daytime. But they added the door to the end of it. So, yeah. We, we were asking the developers if there was anything at the end of it. Because the developers were in, like, the voice chat one day. And someone said, like, nah, there's nothing at the end of it. And the developers said, like, are you sure about that? So, maybe there actually is something at the end. So, once you get to the door, I, if you do get to the door, I recommend moving, a, not moving around a lot so you, because we don't want you to fall off. But, like, click the door and stuff, 
try like everything you can to see if something happens. And if it does, make sure to contact me on my Discord server. So yeah. But I'm real I'm really hoping I can get to the end. There's probably I feel like there's not gonna be anything, but I will try my best. So yeah, that is gonna be all for this video. So make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications, and I will see y'all in the next video.